Hey guys, so I'm going to share one of my favorite Bible verses with you and kind of just what it means to me. Um, so I chose Romans 12:2, which reads, Do not conform to the pattern of this world, but be transformed by the renewing of your mind. Then you will be able to test and approve what God's will is, his good, pleasing, and perfect will. Um, so what I kind of take from that is that Anything that isn't good, acceptable, and perfect is not from God and is not of God. Um, and it kind of makes you think, you know, then why do bad things happen if God is so perfect and created everything? Um, I don't know. I don't think he creates bad things, um, but I do think he lets bad things happen um, because of free will, original sin, and the fall. Um, but the thing about God and that he is so perfect and amazing is that he can turn those bad things for good if we go to him and we let him. Um, I think the world tells us that bad things aren't good and we shouldn't suffer, um, pleasure over pain, you know? Um, but the thing about God is if we give our sufferings over to him as a kind of sacrifice, he can use our pain to help other people that we may not even know are suffering as well. Um, and who need his grace even more than we do. Um, so I think we should just embrace this pain and suffering of life as just, just a part of life, and that if we go to God um, to help us through these things, then we're better off that way, and we can grow as Christians and um, in a relationship with him. Um, so just to close um, as a prayer, I'm going to read um, Romans 15.5. Um, it says, May the God of steadfastness and encouragement grant you to live in such harmony with one another in accordance with Jesus Christ. Um, so I hope this is some encouragement for you. Um, if any of you are going through something hard and awful and just not good, um, just know that God is with you and uh, we as a team are with you as well. So God bless.